The VG Biomass's full turnkey solution starts with a, a free site survey consultation through the design and delivery of a, a fuel store, the agitation discharging system taking the fuel to the boiler, the installation of the boiler, the commissioning and the RHI accreditation of your installation and then the RHI payments. We walk customers right through from the start of that process until completion. So welcome along to, to VG Biomass's install and this is a, a fuel storage area with around 75 metres cubed of, of 15 to 20% dry chip. This is G30 chip. This will last this customer around two months and there's currently about 15 to 20 tonnes of static load here at the moment. The fundamental design principles of this fuel storage area is to have a solid flat concrete base for ease of loading as well as an access door which allows and facilitates that. To have ventilation here along all sides of the, of the, of the storage area which allows for natural air movement um, and also provides cooling ventilation for the boiler room itself and also combustion ventilation to allow for the correct burn of the chip. The Perspex panels in the, the roof here are, are part of the design of the, the fuel store. This provides natural light, some solar gain and can liberate some of the moisture from the chip as well. We have vapour lock lights which, pre which prevent moisture ingressing the electrical circuits and also any dust during delivery. So we have a static wood pile here under which is an articulated arm discharging system. What this means is that when the pile is low, the arms come out, spring out and sweep the chip in. When we load with a, with a heavier pile, the arms come in and sweep a lesser area. So to, to prevent stress on the articulated arm system, but also to sweep an uneven, uneven sweep across the discharging system into the fuel intake of the boiler. In this particular installation, we have the customer's fuel store located perpendicular to the boiler room. This is our client's main boiler room here, housing his RHK Heizomat boiler. We also have the ventilation system that you've seen earlier, where he can close the door over when he's having chip delivered to prevent dust entering the boiler room. Also, this provides the free flow of ventilation for combustion in the boiler and cooling of the, the boiler house area. We have, remember, the articulated arm agitator. We have that through there on a separate drive and a separate motor, feeding chips into the open channel of this ogre here. The pickup ogre then brings chip through now into this closed channel to be picked up by the chain conveyor, which allows the transportation of increased amounts of chip, larger chip, um, and also at the top here, we have a control system that if the, we overfeed, or there's a blockage underneath, the spring-loaded device breaks an electrical switch and prevents any more chip being fed. We also have a flood valve here, so if we get any burn back past the rotary valve, this temperature sensor pocket picks that temperature up and floods the, the chain conveyor with, with fresh cold water. So this part of the, the feed system here, we've got Heizomat's unique four-chamber rotary valve with four blades dual purpose really, the, uh, the rotary valve will break down any larger pieces of material, slithers of wood and larger chips into smaller chunks for the last ogre driven section and it also it provides four chambers to ensure there is always separation between the, the chip being fed into the boiler where there's a fire and then the fuel store. So this is your fire separation point. So the final part of this boiler feed system is the in-feed motor and auger. So this takes the, the chip in its last journey up in to the burn chamber of the boiler. So you can see I've stripped off now, uh, the jacket's off because it is quite warm in here today, which is unusual for an installation. The boiler was just commissioned yesterday, so we're in the process of arranging the insulation for the pipes for later in the week. So all the, the ogres and, and motors, and indeed fans, are controlled by this Siemens TS7 touchscreen controller which allows full interaction and functionality to be seen and interfaced by the customer to move through different sequences. It's currently on an ignition sequence um, which is a fire bed forming the ignition of the chip. We have some additional emergency features here. The emergency stop button in the events of emergency allows you to kill all the power to the full machinery and boiler. If I open it up you can see that it's a very advanced controlled system and one of the most advanced in the biomass marketplace. 
VG electricians always leave a very professional, expert job in the wireless panel up. To underline VG Energy's bespoke approach, we can have your farm name or business name laser cut into the boiler. Okay, so we can open the boiler case and door. In the RHK series boiler, we have a hemispherical pattern. These de-ash the heat exchangers and also provide turbulation to provide an efficient heat transfer from the flueways, the gases, to the water jacket. We have the primary and secondary air blowers, which are controlled either by the control panel or lambda sensor. So as we come to the opposite end of the boiler, you can see the unique selling point of the Heisemat RHK boiler, which is a chain extraction floor, which scrapes heavier materials, metals or clinkers formed in the firebed. If we open the boiler door, you can currently see the firebed forming. The fire is not long automatically ignited. The, the holes you can see in the secondary air holes you can see in either side of the, the flame will be completely covered by the firebed at full operation. You've only got a partial firebed covering at the moment and you can also see the blades in the chain of the extraction system in the base there. So here we have the automatic ash extraction for the RHK series boiler. This automatically de-ashes the boiler up into this domestic size steel, steel wheelie bin. Now it's quite amazing here that one tonne of wood chip only produces a kilo of ash. So the 10, 20 tonnes that is through there just now will only produce 10 kilos of ash. This customer will empty this bin probably twice a year, which is an incredible leap forward in efficiency for these chip boilers. A VG Biomass safety and quality are paramount, and as you can see, we always install a hardwired carbon monoxide alarm to ensure our customer safety at all times. We also install the highest quality safety headers to ensure the boiler protection and the longevity of your installation. All our installations also encompass a low water pressure monitoring system. This again is quite unique in the installation of biomass. This will alarm and inform the customer when the system requires pressure. At VG Biomass, we pride ourselves in the quality of our installations, the quality of our cabling, cable tray, pipe work, pumps and pressure gauges. Our pumps are German made Velo pumps to the highest quality possible. Our pipe work here is not yet insulated as the installation was only completed and commissioned yesterday. Our current flue is a twin wall insulated 350mm diameter flue. All Heisemat and VG installed products have met and passed the emission certification set in the UK and will meet your corporate social responsibility. At VG Biomass we will install the highest quality products. This is an ACV smart cylinder which provides enormous quantities of hot water at peak demand. As you can see, we also install Gerberit Marpress pipe work, which again is of the highest quality. Here we can see a UH25 25 kilowatt air blower delivering heat to the customer's unique rally facility here, and also the quality of the, the bracketing used to hold the air heat. In this particular facility, the client requested that we followed the natural shape of the A-frame RSJs of the, of the steel structure. As you can see, we will always try to accommodate bespoke fit uh, and, and blend the pipe work in to the natural environment that we've installed it in.